How's it going, everybody? Arthur Bryce here, winners and warners.com, and today we have one NBA game that we are discussing for the Monday, May 27, 2020, 24. Happy Memorial Day for everybody who has a day off. And we have a promotion running over at winnersandwinners.com where you guys can save 40% off one of our biggest sales that we've had since I've been going. 40% off on all of my packages until further notice if you use the promo code H-U-R-G-4-R-F-4-0. That is all one word, no spaces. Make sure to go check out my profile as well as some of our other top performers. As an addition to this video that you guys are getting for free on YouTube.com, you get access to my written picks as well as what I'm betting on throughout the day so you guys are always in the loop. Again, winnersandwinners.com, promo code H-U-R-G-4-R-F-4-0, 40% off until further notice. Also, go check out the links in the description below, links to all of our affiliate sportsbook promotional signups. So if you guys are in the market for a new sportsbook or just want to take advantage of some free bonus bets, make sure to go check it out in the, in the description. Uh, go check those, go, those guys out. Use our link. to Get some free bonus bets that you could use. Maybe you could use it on this game that we're going to discuss now. Game four of the Eastern Conference Finals between the Boston Celtics and the Indiana Pacers. Uh, Celtics looking for the series sweep. They are 3-0 right now. Uh, they're dominating. They're coming off of a 114-111 road win uh, where they basically snuck up from behind and won the game. Looks like the Pacers were going to win that one. Uh, but right now, it's, the big story is going to be Tyrese Halliburton. Uh, he's questionable with a hamstring injury. He did not play in game three. So it's going to be very interesting to see how he does here. Also, Kristaps Porzingis, I know he's ruled out for this game, but this was essentially the target date that they were trying to do. So if the series continues or if they advance here, be prepared for some Kristaps Porzingis very soon. Uh, but right now the spread is Boston minus seven and a half. I feel comfortable taking that seven and a half. I feel like this Pacers team is just uh, exhausted. They had a seven game series against the Knicks. Right now, Tyrese Halliburton might not be playing. Uh, I just think, obviously, that's a massive blow to that Pacers team. And right now, they're down 3 0. I think they're just going to end up falling to the wayside here. Uh, Drew Holiday is also a game-time decision, according to ESPN. Uh, they don't really provide uh, reasoning why, but I think, obviously, Drew Holiday plays. I think Boston has five of the top seven players, especially if Tyrese Halliburton is not on the court. So I just don't see a situation where we have a game three, essentially, where it is a close game at the end. I just think Boston has more of a game two situation where they just dominate. And I'm going to go with Boston minus seven and a half as my play for this game. But that's all I have for you guys today. Make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe if you have not already. And I will see you guys in the next one.